This video demonstrates the use of QV curves, one of the functions available in the Transmission Network Tools toolbox. Study Case 05 Transmission Network Tools QV and Scenario Base Scenario should be active. QV curves can be used when analyzing the voltage stability of a network. They show the sensitivity of the voltage of a node with respect to reactive power. A node is stable under particular conditions as long as increased reactive power is associated with increased voltage. First, we'll check that the base load flow has a valid solution. This icon is used to configure the QV curves analysis. The bus bars to be analysed are selected here. In this example, we'll examine the northwest part of the network by selecting just the transmission level bus bars in that area. We execute the calculation. We can now use the QV curves plot icon to plot a QV curve for the most critical bus bar. We can also see in the output window that the two most critical bus bars are these two, which are at substation NW03, and the critical voltage is 0.883 per unit. Let's now look at these two bus bars in more detail by calculating QV curves under fault conditions. This will be done by considering contingencies. We can first select the bus bars from the output window and copy them. This can then be used to modify the set of nodes to be analysed. The option to consider contingencies is selected. The contingency command has already been configured in this example to consider all transmission bus bar faults in the northeast. The analysis is run. And a QV curve for the critical bus bar plotted. It can be seen that the critical contingency is a bus bar fault in substation NE04 and the critical voltage is 0.923 per unit.